Pike Place Market of Seattle, Washington is known for having various small vendors, countless options for fresh produce, and unique art. This northwestern tourist hotspot allows these vendors and artists to showcase their talents and passions to the world. Most of these pieces I start off by cutting out a stencil, so it's kind of like this one right here. I hand cut it with the X-Acto blade and then um, I spray paint it onto the, the surface, whether it's a canvas or a shirt or whatever. Some of these are my original ideas, but most of them are based on pop culture because I love movies and music. Uh, and I think it's a way that I can relate to people because everybody has like a favorite song or musician, a favorite movie or a favorite actor. Within the market lies the Antique Touch, a small shop that specializes in selling just a few kinds of salt and pepper shakers. Well, there's about 3,000 pairs of salt and pepper shakers and thousands of other things too, including uh, 500 uh, teacups and about 50 teapots. I've worked here part-time 19 years, and to the best that I can remember, no one under 10 or 12 has ever broken anything. It's usually the adults that end up breaking something if anybody does. Another gem within the market is Richard, a jeweler from New York. Although he is found tucked away in the back of the market, his work speaks for itself. Well, it's just, it's, it's what I like to do. It's like if you brought me a rock and you say, Richard, I want you to do this, do what you do your art on it. I, I would, I, I couldn't do it whatever design you wanted. I would let the, I, a lot of times I let the stone do its own thing. So I do what makes me happy. And that's, and that's what I tell people like you, you do what makes you happy. Because if you do what makes you happy, you never work a day in your life. Believe it or not, I don't even try to sell my stuff. I feel my stuff will sell itself. Because the thing is, you believe in what you do. This is Gannon Rushall reporting for Mountain Vista Media.